You're retired, obviously. You're now part of this Women's Veterans Alliance. Is that mm -hmm. yes? Yes. So, how did that come about? And you obviously seem like you're very involved mm -hmm. in that. And it seems that's wow. What encouraged you to be a part of that and want to be supporting other women as well? So, uh, we moved to Sacramento almost five years ago, and um, I just missed the camaraderie. I missed the interaction with other veterans. Mm -hmm. So I just Googled one day like women veterans and it took me to an organization in, in uh, San Francisco and then they gave me uh, Melissa Washington's name and said, you know, she was trying to start something up in Sacramento. Oh. So she started um, almost five years ago with 10 women at El Torito's in Arden and she was just seeing it as a business uh, networking yeah. meeting, right, with other women. Mm -hmm. um, she never envisioned that it would turn out to be what it is now, yeah. almost five years later. Um, but just being able to provide, uh, veterans have a bond, yeah. um, but we really want to provide a safe place for women veterans, mm -hmm. right? And um, some of them aren't a fan of going to the VFW or other yeah. uh, veteran organizations, uh, because again, it's male dominated, right? Yeah. And so, um, I just, uh, I have, you know, I have a full-time job, but what fulfills my heart is being able to provide, um, support to other women or resources or, yeah. or whatever they need and so I just I still needed to feel that sense of service is why I take part in Women Veterans Alliance. Yeah 